Amy, you're just sort of telling me you have a wedding to go to, um, and out there you just breeze through that match. <laughs> oh, I don't know if it was a breeze through. Kevin put up um, a good a good game to us today, and we got it hard. And it, look, the semi finals always hard fought, so we had to stay going till the end. And I'm just very thankful that we got we got through in the end. It's a dream. That's the thing about it for semi finals. No one remembers really how the game goes because everyone remembers the winners. Yeah, exactly. Look, and that was in the back of our heads today. We knew we had to go out there. As strong as we could and play like we have done all year long. I'm so proud of these bunch of girls. They put in so much hard work, um, and I'm just delighted to get to Crow Park. One eleven, your tally for today. Oh, Fantastic. Look, the girls have to get it into me, so they done all the hard work. I was just on the end of it, and the freeze. Sure, I suppose anyone can stand over them and put them over the bar. There's no, no one on say, me for them. You see it, so <laughs> hand, oh yeah, sure anyone can do it. Yeah, how many people have tried and failed now, Amy? Oh, I don't know. Look. It's all about them. the rest of them girls, they're amazing, I couldn't say anything more about them and look we're just delighted to get through, it's going to be a big task ahead now, either of these teams behind me, whoever we meet, it's going to be a big, big day for us and look we'll go and we're not we're not just going to turn up, Like we're, we're going to give it a lash. You're excellent with come on but unfortunately those feet need to be worked on. Uh, yeah, I didn't really know what to do. I flustered myself. I went to throw it and then... Knew you couldn't do it. Yeah, I knew I couldn't and then I just panicked. I don't know what i done. But look, hopefully I'll start out the feet for the next day. <laughs> we'll be watching you now saying, you know, listen, she'll be called up to the, to the Leash football panel now. Oh, you no, mentioned you mentioned Cav and, you know, they got back into the game. You got that goal before half time, and it, it, it did settle you. But then they came back at you and got within one point. Look, we knew Cavan were going to throw everything at us. Um, they're a very physical team, fit team, uh, running off the shoulder, something that you know we really have to work on ourselves. But um, look, you know when you go back to two or you go down one or you go down two, you just have to stay going to find out. you never know what's going to happen. And thank God our hard work pulled through today. You had the 15 players out there, then the girls that come on. You know, it was very much a team performance. 100%. Our panel is amazing, and I've said it all year long. Like, we could not do it without them 31 girls. Like, when you see a girl lining up to come in, you're like, this is brilliant. Like, um, you know, fresh legs. A Jumping at the and, bit. Exactly. And that's what we've been all about this year. Our panel has won that for us there today. And uh, what's it like having the dad on the sideline? What's it like? That's the same when we go home I have to try and say, right, no more camogie anymore now. Do you talk about it? See that's the thing about it, you know, normally kind of people forget about it, but do you still talk about the game when you go home or you just try to shut it off? Look, hundred percent you do. Yeah. You know, it, it wouldn't be normal if we didn't. Um we've grew up and Harlan's just what we've done, me growing up all those years and same with my mum and dad, like they played Harlan and Camogie as well. So it's just what we do. Obviously it's going to be a top conversation. It's like the Sunday game there last night, so <laughs> You've got your own up for the match. Now you have to go for another match now, so I'll let you go off to the wedding. Thanks a million. <laughs>